YouTube, what is going on with y'all big the fools, man? It is your boy, man, Fly Guy Only Man, back at it again with another video. How y'all boys rocking bully glue in the school and on the bit, my a man say man, Gail man. Still cash pan on the bit, man. One time, two times, three times, four. Welcome. If you're here to see this video real quick, man, make sure you hit that like button, rate, subscribe, comment, all that good old stuff, man. This channel right here is pretty much everything that has to do with Call of Duty and stuff like that, man. I'm a big fan of Call of Duty. been playing Call of Duty for a lot of years, man. Not too long ago, started up this channel, and I'm just pushing out content. You feel me, man? Real funny, casual player. I'm not a sweat. Believe me when I say that. I'm far from a sweat. But I just like to play Call of Duty, man. Have fun, man. Sit back, relax, man. Real cool type of dude coming from Chirac, Jill, Illinois. You already know I be rocking. But in this video right here, though, gang, I want to show y'all my gaming setup. How I do everything when it comes to streaming, playing Call of Duty, Warzone, Vanguard, whatever. I just want to show y'all my overall setup and stuff like that, man. Uh, I give this bad boy a pretty much rough estimate of north of $7,000 that I spent on this setup. But I must say, this is well worth the money. So are y'all boys ready to see the setup that I got going on for playing video games? Let's get money, man. Let's go ahead and start this, man. So when you first walk into my room, man, look, this is what you're going to see, man. Boom, bada, bing, bada, boom. This right here is my ghetto setup. Don't pay no attention to the chair, man. When you play a lot of Call of Duty, you get mad. And you want to cut somebody. I'm not Hispanic. And I'm not, you know, trying to put no blame on nobody. But I'm just saying, I got mad that one day and I had to cut something. But no, that's my chair right there. But either though, we're not paying no attention to that. This right here is my streaming gaming setup. I got the flip flops on and stuff like that. You see the feet. I got a steering wheel right there too as well. I got a second channel, man, that has over 12,000 subscribers, stuff like that. I do a lot of gaming stuff with racing and stuff like that. Check it out too as well. But that's not here or there, man. We're talking about Call of Duty right now, man. This right here is my gaming setup that I got, bro. Let's go ahead and check this bad boy out. As you can see, got all the peripherals and stuff like that. Don't pay no attention to the cable management. We, we, we not worried about that. That is what it is. One of these days, I'm going to fix it. But right now, it looks like a spider that's coming from under my desk, though. But look, check this out, though. The first thing I want to show y'all is this desk that I got right here, bro. I paid like $300 for this bad boy. And this is one of those desks that you can rise up or you can rise down. You feel what I'm saying? And it's cool, bro. Like, it's, it's one of those things that you can do all that crazy stuff with, man. You know what I'm saying? So, you can ride that bad boy up and down and stuff like that. Real cool, man. Definitely really wanted to get something like that, man. I really love it. Um, from there, we got my parentheos and stuff like that. Got my mouse. Got my stream deck. Got my keyboard. This right here is one of them HyperX keyboards. This right here is the sound deck. Got a little dust on it, man. I told you, I mean, this is the ghetto setup, bro. I'm just being honest with you when I say this is the ghetto setup, man. Ain't nothing fancy over here, dang. You feel what I'm saying, gang? Ain't nothing fancy over here. But that right there is my soundboard. You know what I'm saying? Streamlabs, stuff like that. I can press these buttons. No. You know what I'm saying? No. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? When I do my live stream and stuff like that, I like to keep everybody entertained and stuff like that. You feel what I'm saying? Back there, you got my, uh, I think this right here is my uh, capture card, my uh, HD 60S Plus. I was going to put one in the PC, but I just never have a chance to, you know, go out and spend the money. But for right now, this right here works just fine, though. And pretty much this is capturing, you know what I'm saying, the gameplay footage from my PlayStation 5 and my Xbox Series S. Uh, I got Call of Duty on there, too, as well. And plus other games and stuff like that that I record and screen capture and all that good old stuff. Blazzy, blazzy jazz. You feel what I'm saying? That right there is my speaker. For my laptop, oh, I say my laptop, Lord have mercy. <laughs> oh, my PC. This right here is my speaker for my PC. Only got one, um, but it's a big old boom box, man. That I can hook up to the auxiliary cord and stuff like that and get all the volume coming out through there. Uh, nine times out of ten, man, when I'm on this bad boy, I got headphones on anyway, so. All I need is this one boom box, man, in the corner, man. That's good enough for me, man. But if I was to turn this bad boy all the way up, right now it's at 10. If I was to turn this all the way up to, I think it goes up to 40. Bro, this thing gets super loud. Like, you can hear this bad boy outside across the street loud. Like, this bad boy gets loud, man. You know what I mean? But other than that, I got my microphone right here. This right here is a short mic. I've uh, been having this bad boy for almost a year now, man. I really love this bad boy. This is probably like one of the best mics that I have ever bought. I'm going to tell you all one thing, right? Being the content creator, bro. It's not always about the visuals. More like is all about the audio. I learned that real quick, bro. The visuals, people will, you know, lack lesson with the with the visuals, man. They can put up with subpar quality visuals. But when it comes to audio, though, you got to make sure your audio is on point. I'm going to tell you that right now. And this short mic right here, man, my audio is on point. I got that bad boy running to an interface that's right there. 
that interface is running USB into the back of the PC and stuff like that. And it's doing this dog deals, man. Really love it. Really like it. The best thing ever. Um, that right there is my uh, little colorful lights that I be having. Got colorful lights right there too as well. The reason why you see that on the floor, it was on the wall, but I went to sleep one night and I woke up the next morning and it was all on the floor. I don't know what happened. I, I, honestly, I do not know what happened. So that's what we got going on right there. You feel me? It, it, it all fell and I got to put it back up. But for right now, it's on the floor though. But I do got little lights and stuff like that. So, you know, the background could be all colorful and glittery and rainbows and all types of crazy stuff. You know how I be rocking that. But other than that, I got a USB hub back there and stuff like that for some perfumes that you can plug up and stuff like that. You feel me? Up here is my camera. This right here is a Sony ZV-1. As you can see right there, it's recording me and stuff like that when I sit right here. You know what I'm saying? Fully plugged up into the computer and stuff like that. You can see, you know what I'm saying? Me right there and stuff like that. Got the light on top right there. I, I was thinking about getting some more lights to put around here to make it a little bit more, you know, colorful and a little bit more vibrant. But for right now, this does the thing. and does the job. So I'm cool with that. Um, Got some audio foam and stuff like that. You know what I mean? You know, a little, little simple stuff. A little simple stuff, man. You feel me? So now, before we talk about the day on PC itself, let's talk about one other thing that I got, right? Now, recently, I was using a regular Xbox controller. This right here is my stash right here. You know what I'm saying? This is where all my controllers, my headphones, condoms, you know what I mean? Where extra wheels. This is where I got everything at and stuff like that. You know what I mean? So, at first... I was using a regular Xbox controller and stuff like that, right? As you can see, I got two Xbox controllers down here. I got, you know, multiple PlayStation 5 controllers and stuff like that. You know what I'm saying? Uh, there's a black one somewhere right here. Oh, yeah, right here. No, I got put multiple controllers and stuff like that. You know what I mean? So, at first, I was using, you know what I mean, uh, my uh, regular Xbox controller, whatever the case may be. But I went out recently, like a week ago, and I went and got this controller right here. And I must say, this right here has really been a game changer for me, bro. This right here is, I want to say, the Victor uh, Xbox controller. It costs like $100. You can get it from GameStop or online or something like that. It has back paddles and stuff like that. And another thing that I like about this controller, even though it has back paddles, uh, these buttons right here, I can change the sensitivity of the trigger pull. So right now, I got it on hair, uh, hair finger trigger. So basically, when I press it like this, this is how far the trigger is going back. That far so i could just tap it and then shoot i don't gotta you know press the trigger all the way in for it to respond i could just boom 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 and it's going in you feel me got the uh you know say i think you call these uh the control freaks uh on my uh you know thumb pads and stuff like that got that going on and stuff like that this is a nice controller man they say this is like one of the fastest controllers uh when it comes to response rate and stuff like that in the world so that's why i had to get it. it's nice lightweight it's wired plugged straight into the pc up there and stuff like that i really like it. i'm still trying to get used to it but i really like that bad boy but this is all my other parentheses and stuff like that chargers cables wires and stuff like that hey one thing about if you got a gaming setup one thing that you need to buy and i'm gonna tell you this right now this is a big secret this is a big big secret right here is a vacuum it's a vacuum cleaner in here Buy yourself a vacuum cleaner, man. Because one thing about, you know what I'm saying, your setup, your setup is going to get dusty. And when it gets dusty, you need to clean it out. Buy yourself a vacuum cleaner, man. I told you that first. So let's go ahead and hide the drug stash spot real quick. A lot of people don't even know, you know what I'm saying, it's an area right here, man. But this is where I hide everything at and stuff like that. Shh, don't tell nobody what's going on in there. But nonetheless, the last thing that we finna talk about is the big boy itself. And that's my PC. This right here is a custom built PC. Uh, I'm running, uh, well, let's, let's just start off the top, man. Uh, CPU wise is a uh, 10th gen, uh, 10th gen 10700K um, overclocked and stuff like that. Uh, CPU, well, GPU, I should say, is a uh, 3080 Ti. You know what I'm saying? Um, RAM is a uh, 32 uh, gigs of uh, G Skull, you know, what I'm saying running at I think 3200 megs or something like that. Um, my uh, what you call it, AIO or something like that is a water pump, you know, what I'm saying with you know, what I'm saying the cooler up there and stuff like that, the radiator up there and stuff like that. I got two terabytes M.2 and I also got another five terabytes of a uh, regular SSD or hard drive or whatever you want to call it. 
thing. You know, you got all the fans and stuff like that, or whatever the case may be. Blase, blase. Got a uh, EVGA, uh, I think it's a 750 watt or maybe an 850 watt uh, power supply. And I'm gonna say, this right here, I pretty much spec'd it out. The only thing that I wanna change right now is my CPU and get a faster CPU. But I must say, this bad boy right here controls everything. When I say everything, you got a lot of uh, content creators and streamers that like to do the, the two PC or the PC laptop, you know, combo stream and stuff like that. This right here does it all. It does the streaming and the gameplay. As you can see, all off of one system. I got the stream up, stream labs and stuff like that. Got that up right there. And I got the game up right here. That's how I do everything. Some people, you know what I'm saying, and yes, I do take a little performance hit and stuff like that, but everything still stays above like 100 and like 70, you know what I'm saying, frames per second. Because this monitor that I got right here is a Samsung uh, Odyssey G7 or something like that. Uh, it, it's, it's only a 4K 144 hertz. It's not one of them 1080p's, 240 hertz, nothing like that. So anything over 144 hertz, I'm not benefiting from it anyway. So I'm cool with that. And this right here is just a standard Dell, regular 1080p, 60 or 75 hertz, nothing special. You know what I mean? So these are my two monitors. This is the main monitor that I game on. When I play all my games, I game and play everything on this monitor. This is a 28 inch right here. And when it comes to my streaming or just whatever else, this is my second monitor where I do everything else at and stuff like that. You know what I mean? So that's how I got everything, you know what I'm saying, fitting up in here. And I must say. For how I got anything up in this bad boy, I really like it. It really fits my needs and stuff like that. I really rock with it, man. You know what I'm saying? Like, I have so much fun doing this stuff, man. It is crazy, man. But I just had to show y'all real quick, man. My, you know what I'm saying? Gaming setup when it comes to Call of Duty and stuff like that. You know what I mean? Other than that, don't pay attention to that. That's some dirty clothes right there. I got to throw that away. You know, Well, not throw it away, but I, I got to wash that. Is one of y'all going to come over here and wash that for me? I don't think so. So, shh, don't tell nobody that there's some dirty clothes behind you. I, I could easily do this right here. Y'all would never have seen it. But I try to keep it funky with y'all. But anywho, I hope y'all like my uh, game and streaming setup and stuff like that. Um, let me know how y'all, you know what I'm saying, setups is and stuff like that, man. Follow me on Discord. Follow me on Instagram and stuff like that. Everything is the same, man. Fly guy only 773. Follow me on anything. Just type in on Google, fly guy only 773. I'm going to pop up everywhere. You feel me? But other than that, man, nothing but peace, love, and positivity. I'm about to here, man. Gang, gang to the end, man. Y'all have a blessed one. Y'all have a safe one. And make sure y'all stay tuned, man, and catch me in one of my live streams, man. I go live pretty much every day on Twitch and on YouTube. And I got daily videos and uploads, too, as well, man. So make sure y'all stay tuned, man, if you rock with the Call of Duty content and the Call of Duty community. But other than that, gang, gang to the end. I'm about to here. Peace, love, and blessings. I'm gone, man. How I mean the next one, man. Let's get money out here, man.